G'day and welcome, my name is Matthew. In this video I'm going to look at the Rowita controller and RD Works, and we're going to have a look at the Ultimate Air Assist where we can select the layers for blowing on or blowing off but also the modes of uh, blowing. So in RD Works there's two options for air assist blowing. The first option is blowing while laser on. So that means whenever the laser is firing the air assist will click on and off when the laser is not firing. So if we have an engraving job where it's the lasers on and off throughout the process of a sweep, the pneumatic solenoid will click on and off between each time the laser is firing. The other option that we have is the processing mode and that would switch on the air assist at the beginning of the processing and still control whether each layer has a uh, option for blowing yes or no but then it would switch off at the end of the processing. Hopefully by explaining through RD Works and showing you an example it'll explain it a little bit better and you can set your machine to what you prefer. So when you have a layer that you want to engrave, you can go in and select whether you want the full air assist on or whether you want it off. And you do that down here by if blowing yes or no. So if you don't want air on while you're engraving, you select no and uh, then there'll just be a small amount of air running through the nozzle to protect the lens from uh, any debris and smoke buildup. If we have air assist on full, then there's air blowing onto the workpiece while we're doing our cutting or engraving. So this uh, if blowing is controlled by two modes and those modes can be seen on the user tab by going into the user tab and other. And you have here blow type laser on blow or we have processing blow. What we're going to do is uh, read the information from the controller and it's currently set as laser on blow. So what we'll do is I'll show you the uh, example of doing some engraving with this option or this mode in place and have a listen for the pneumatic solenoid clicking on and off every time that the laser is firing. So each line is the laser's firing, it clicks on and it clicks off again at the end of that line and then it starts the process all over again. So you'll hear repeated click, 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 click. I've placed the microphone next to the pneumatic solenoid so that you can hear it better. So as you can see that can be quite uh, annoying that clicking and it's unnecessary to have the pneumatic solenoid clicking on and off every time that the laser is firing. We want to have it on and controlled during the processing only. So we want to set processing blow and write that to the controller. I'll run the same program again. This time listen you should hear the click at the beginning of the processing. It'll do its engraving and then at the end it will click off. So we just got the pneumatic solenoid coming on and off just at one time. So I hope you found this video useful, if you did like it give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified when I release new videos. You'll find my YouTube channel at youtube.com forward slash mwlaser. And until next time, take care, cheers.